Then this Dimensionator was stolen by Dr. Nefarious, who used it to bring you here? Now you just have to find your friend, who is also miraculously a Lombax, to save the day. And get home. <laughs> you must seriously think I'm an idiot. Look, as real as I'm sure this Dr. Nefarious is, this has the Emperor written all over it. Help! They under attack! Anyone? Mort? What's going on? <gasps> oh dear. Race for impact! Oh. Look out! What do you think I'm doing? Go! Where are you taking me? I was gonna take you to my hideout. But first, I gotta rescue my friends at their gelatonium factory. my hideout. I haven't been out this far in a while. But a lot of swamp acid between here and the Morton Gelatonium factory. Those beetles appear to have no issue with the acidic swamp water. Speedles, yeah. That's why I'm gonna ride one. As soon as I can get close enough. Ratchet, can you read me? Oh dear, my communicator must be broken. Of course. Morts will be at the Gelatonium Factory. Gotta find a way through the swamp. Dimensional distortion is emanating from that cave. And the last speedo runs into that rift. Alright, smarty bot. What is this place? I, um, a dimensional pocket? Perhaps a symptom of the Dimensionator's destruction. How do you come up with this stuff? Hey, it's Maynard, the Mortz's helper bot. Must have wandered in through the rift somehow. There is the Speedle. No, no, don't hide! Ugh. Hitting...
can lead me to the boards. from this acid. Come on, Maynard! Let's find the morse! Excuse me! Look out! I got it! I got it! See? Sometimes I don't crash. Gelatonium factory. I'm coming, Norts. We didn't follow that Lombax and his Robopet across dimensions just to get stopped by some fuzzballs. So you got like nine and a half seconds to tell us where they're at. One. <laughs> Hang on there now. See? They are looking for Ratchet. I am telling the truth. Whatever, Bolts. I'm gonna save my friends. Great. You don't want to test my number skills, Sport. Oh, keep going. You're doing good so much. Hey, I know where you can find a Lombax. There's another Lombax. Tell us where your friend is, Josephina. Call in the dogs, dog. Where are these doofuses coming from? Perhaps they were sucked through the dimensional vortex as well. It keeps getting bigger. Oh, between that and our new neighbor up there, we are not doing too fine. <sighs> Don't worry, I'll take care of it. Oh, and to keep you all busy while I'm gone, got this at Zerkey's. Mort can finally fix that ship she's been working on. Zerkey's? Oh, those pirates didn't give you any trouble, did they? Eh, only a little. You can give this to Mort yourself once you get her from that purple mess over there. Ah! Okay! Do not enter. Got it. May I take a look? I have some experience with dimensional anomalies. I... sure. Hmm. Ah. Ah. Great 
Greetings! Welcome! How did you get in here? Where exactly is, um, here? Oh, you don't know? Well, I don't either. It appears to be a space between dimensions. Could be nothing. Could be a cascading entropic fissure that will soon turn the entire universe into a formless soup. Time will tell. Oh. Oh, dear. Well, I am Clank. Please allow me to help. Right, yes, Clank. I am the all-seeing cosmic prophet of interdimensional sector 2255 phase Omega. But you can call me Gary. Here we are, Clank. Former warbot, uh, teamed up with the Lombax. Became a hero. Who good for you? Ooh. Ooh, friend of my father. I see. Your father? You might just be the one I've been waiting for. Would you like to help me fix the dimensions? Do you know how to fix the dimensions? And why are there copies of me running around? They're your possibilities. The key to repairing the tsunami. But first, pick up that nearby sphere. This is a lift sphere. It can reduce the gravity on any object it touches. It seems your possibilities are what keeps an anomaly from collapsing. They look like you because that's how you interpret dimensionality. But, as you can see, they've lost their way. If you can guide them to the Meta-Terminal ahead, you will begin to repair this anomaly. Terminal, and you'll be one step closer to fixing this dimensional anomaly. I feel like things are slowly starting to make sense, dimensionally speaking. Get you moving. I bet some extra speed could make quick work of that barrier. Do you live on Sargasso too, Gary? Zavali, actually. I've been studying in the archive. It's the greatest repository of dimensional knowledge I've ever seen. I wonder if some extra speed could help my possibilities cross this gap.
wonder if some extra speed could help my possibilities cross this gap. device may be able to redirect my possibilities. There must be a way to activate it. I wonder if some extra speed could help my possibilities cross this gap. I wonder if some extra speed could help my possibilities cross this gap. at this clay. I am cautiously optimistic. I feel myself learning something by completing these puzzles, but I cannot explain what it is. The words will come to you when you are ready. Now, lead your possibilities to the final meta-terminal. And not to stress you out, but... There's a lot riding on this. Like, a lot, a lot. I hope I'm not interrupting your process, but I think there are more spheres left to find. If I fix this anomaly, will that fix all the damage that has been done in this dimension? Oh, no. Anomalies are spreading too quickly to do that. I'm afraid a dimensional cataclysm is coming, and our only hope to stop it is with that which caused it. The Dimensionator? Indeed. But if repairing anomalies is helping you learn about dimensionality, I think you'll soon be able to learn enough to save us all. I wonder if I will be able to solve all of this in the end. What makes you say that? It has been a long time since I have been a hero. And with everything that happened with the Dimensionator, I am concerned. 
in times of great stress, which seems to be every day of my life, <laughs> I've always found it best to take things one step at a time. Focus on what's in front of you. I may offer one thought. Perhaps it would be beneficial to explore the area for more spheres. Give me a lift. I wonder if some extra speed could help my possibilities cross this gap. That's it, Clank! You repaired the anomaly! And now we're one step closer to stopping the dimensional cataclysm! Then I says, listen, Mort, you, Mort, and Mort better hide that lemonade before Mort shows up. Whoa! You saved them! How did you do that? I... am uncertain. Oh, Rivet! How the heck are you? Look who it is! <laughs> <laughs> you would not believe my luck today. My trip to Nefarious City went totally sideways. I wrecked my ship, and I... Uh -huh. You go on and leave that one to old Mort. <laughs> well, assuming you brought that part I asked for, hmm? I'll have this old thing in ship shape. <laughs> Just gotta lower the bridge, and then I'm taking you to my hideout. 
What are we going to do there? You'll find out soon enough. This wasn't what was in my account last time. Oh, that is because I added our mutual friend on Nefarious City. Okay. Spider turret that warps your foes into defenseless trimmable hedges. Getting the point? Hit them over and over again with the ricochet. Ah, the ricochet. Pull the fire trigger to shoot it at your useless enemy. Oh, oh, oh my! And then it will pop back up next to them. Then what? Pull the fire trigger to hit them again and again and again. Boop, 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 boop. back for upgrades when you level that up. this bad gal up for access to more upgrades.
float, Maynard. Yes, try aiming at the rift.
as well. suggesting this, but what about the speedle? What about it? that these locks must be hit quickly. Yep, morts are funny like that. <clears throat> Time to find out the truth about you. Mm -hmm. If only I could talk with Ratchet. Are you so hesitant to trust me? Look, robots aren't really my thing. Especially when they're tearing my galaxy apart. I am not. I was trying to help Ratchet find the other Lombaxes. 
We'll see the truth soon enough. Once I scan you and the infobot I found in Nefarious City. This is extremely unnecessary. Okay. So, you were being honest. As I have been saying, Repeatedly. You're nefarious. He looks a lot like mine. Evil like him, too. And that Lombax. I know it might sound crazy, but... You think he is your dimensional counterpart. Or something. Look, whatever's going on here, we're gonna fix it. We? I thought robots are not your thing. Not all of them, just most. You know, like the Emperor, his stupid followers, pirates. Yeah, I see the irony too. Oh, I apologize. I did not mean to, um... You feel bad? Even though I just watched your brain diary thingy? 